Only News 5 is trying to get to the bottom of this creepy, crawly pest problem. We found these ants inside a Richmond Heights apartment complex and found out they're just the beginning of the concerns there. People who live at 444 Park say they also have a laundry list of service and security complaints. They've been dealing with broken elevators, security doors, and laundry room appliances. So what could they do? But turn to Five on Your Side investigator Joe Paganakis for help. Residents at the 444 Park apartment say they're tired of dealing with multiple issues at the complex. That's why they're hoping that the Richmond Heights Building Department here will finally step in to help. I kill probably 30 to 40 a day in my apartment. And they're everywhere. Robert Adele says feral ants attacking his apartment have filled his day-to-day -day life with anxiety and frustration. Yeah, I think it's I think it's disgusting actually. Adele says management brought in an exterminator last month, but it hasn't had an impact. Yeah, they, they know it's an issue. I mean, I've got 30 some videos of ants on different days at different times. Management issuing these notices to each unit on Adele's floor, but he says it's not clear when they'll follow up. I can't even get management to speak to me anymore. Um, I mean, literally, they won't return my phone calls. Uh, the mailboxes are always broken. The doors, security uh, doors are always broken. This tenant, too afraid to be seen on camera, said the ant attack isn't the only issue, that there are a host of safety and service problems at the complex. So all the washers and dryers are broken. We've been telling them about that. Nothing. And we pay a lot of money in this building and nothing gets done. And residents we talked to say they tried to contact the Richmond Heights Building Department, but so far no one has received a response. Management here won't call you back. The city won't call you back. The building department won't call you back. I don't know. I mean, I'm at a loss. Adele said he even contacted the Cuyahoga County Health Department, but it's out of their jurisdiction. In the last three years, they've changed management companies three times. Uh, if you're looking for resident retention, this isn't the way to go about it. And we contacted the management team at 444 Park Apartments. It would only say that it does have an extermination policy in place and that it will continue to follow up with issues at that complex. Reporting here in Richmond Heights, I'm 5 on your side investigator Joe Paganakis.